Let's do this. Wow. Starting off with a goober is interesting. Um, This is going to be risky, but I feel like I should do it anyways. We got 12 gold. I do want to use this goober. Because starting off with a goober is interesting. And I kind of do want to get a spike shield as well. Just to start off with. So I'm going to do that. I was thinking about getting this wooden sword just for an activator for the goober to make it heal more. Other than just flying Arlick. But I'm going to just do this and get that get that spike shield and this person only has a sword which <laughs> this is the dumbest battle ever <laughs> oh my god that was the dumbest battle ever wow okay well good game um i'm gonna get this broom space so i can actually use the broom do like this that'll work honestly i think it's probably better just to utilize the spike shield um as an activator for the goober right like this because this is that's every five seconds this is bound to activate more times than the flying arlick will as far as you're going against somebody with double dps right like right that's like a thing right see already activating this guy is still not activated yet and the second one see two to one so yeah that was definitely a better play Unless we want to get something that just maybe have one DPS or something. But either way, early rounds, almost everyone has two DPS. Good game. I'm going to take you. I'm looking for space, really. Got my space, but I'm kind of broke. Kind of broke. Um, I think we're going to probably get this broom. Leather bag. Oh, I should probably get this garlic. I'm going to get the garlic now. Cause I don't feel like getting it later. So we're going to rock this <laughs> going to rock this probably going to lose this one. Only reason is because of the chili. He's got infinite heat. Plus having a banana there helps. I did not see this pan though. I think he wins without the pan because the pan is draining his stamina versus the burning torch. I don't know. That's what I feel like at least personally. I don't know. Maybe he still wouldn't win because we got three spikes. I don't know. I feel like his build would have been better without that, uh, without that pan there. Um, let's put you right here. I mean, I could, I could just maybe do something like this instead. Maybe turn 90, a little situation like so. And then do this like that. Like that's not horrible, right? I don't know. The food isn't inside of the Reaper bag, which is like the biggest concern, but maybe it's not that big of a concern. I mean, we got blind, we got poison, we got spikes, we got healing. We got everything but stamina realistically, but in these early rounds, I feel like we're just going to win. Eventually, stamina is going to creep on us, but eventually, is it now? You know what I mean? Let's get you roll. Um, I say we probably go ahead and get this fanny pack situation. That way I can move these two down by one. Do this and then put those inside of the Reaper bag, which will be extremely beneficial for us. Um, I don't really want anything here. So I'm gonna roll a blueberry. Do I want a blueberry? I do want a blueberry. We'll take this blueberry. Um, probably should take the cap of resilience just to combat against uh, dagger builds, which is a thing. Interesting start. He's got Fortuna's Grace with a broom. A little bit of food situation. Okay, this is like a decent battle. And he's also got what four luck so far, and that is just, so our blind really doesn't matter. He's gonna have 100% accuracy either way. So we're really just betting on probably just spikes here with his broom, and that's really about it. That's all we have. Other than that, we're probably gonna lose this, I think, because he's gonna start critting, and we're just not. And yep, almost though. Very close. Extremely close. So let's. What we got? Ten gold. I do need this box of riches. Um, but I think the better play here would probably be to get a blueberry. Do a little situation like this. Um, probably get another health potion as well is probably good. And a cap is good. Only got nine. I'd say we probably get box of riches and probably potion belt. I think that would be the better plays here. Realistically. I'm gonna do this. I don't... Mm, maybe not. Maybe not do that. Because that's got to go there. That's got to go there. Yeah, this works. Boom. And then we can do boom. I'm going to buy that. We'll buy that next round. And I still need space. Well, not still need. I just need it in general. Let's see what we got here. 
This is a berserker. The only weapon. Oh, okay. I didn't see the pan. We got a pan and a forging hammer. Yeah, we're probably gonna win this. Blind is a thing. He has no clover generation. 55% accuracy already. And then spikes is gonna help us out. Poison is ramping up. That is game. Good game. Space, nice. And I'm broke. <laughs> but we needed that just to fit those two in there. And we'll just go with this. This'll work. <laughs> Ranger bow and arrow with you didn't get your sword yet for your still goober, thankfully. Looks like he's probably gonna run still goober, double bow and arrow probably with double shield more than likely. More than likely. I kinda want a banana for myself so I can stop uh honking over here. That would be really nice. Either way, we're still probably gonna win this more than likely. Yep. Good game. And let's go with the cauldron here. Um nah, I'll get the gloves. Roll. I'm looking for a mana orb. That's kind of what I need right now. Is a nice, juicy, beautiful orb of mana. I'm gonna start making some risky plays here, I think. Um, I think what we're going to do is do this. Boom, or wait, no, that doesn't work. What well, kind of? We can make it work. We can make it work. I'm gonna move these fannies though, eventually. I don't know which one, but we're gonna move them. Um, but we're gonna do this. This cauldron can go here, and we can just go ahead and just fanny one of these, I suppose. Like that works. That can go in there. Uh, do like that. Uh. Don't really have a spot for this shield. Oh, actually, yeah, yes, I do. I can put it up there. Boom, boom. I do want to get this fanny though, which I could just sell this pocket sand and this. So I don't really need either one of those. So I think so, that's what we're going to do. Just buy this guy and we can put you here, I guess. <laughs> that like that, that works. We'll put it there. That goes there. Um, I wish I could do this food situation a little bit better, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. I think we're just going to put a garlic there and yeah, we're just going to roll with this. Actually, wait, this needs to be, this needs to be a mana potion actually. So I can't get the upgrade yet because I need to turn these into a mana potion. Hmm. But also means we're going to be out one activator. Unless I just do this. Right. Blueberry can go there. We can use this as an activator and then just do that. All right, we're going to do that. That works for me. That works for me. We're going to do this. Ah. Okay, he doesn't have the Bloodthorn yet, but still having a Nocturnal Locklifter is like really good when you first get it. It's just really, really good. Really, 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 really good. Stamina, of course, is an issue because everything is just faster. So that sucks. But at least our blind is affecting, you know, 55%, 65% right there, which is really good for us. And it was us having 20 freaking heat. Everything just gets faster, including the healing. Oh, ah, that, oh, barely, barely. Stamina generation there would have helped. Man, okay, we're gonna get both of these. I need that. This is what I need. This is what I need. We're gonna sell this. We're selling that. We're selling this. Give me that. Give me a magic staff. Next round, we're selling this broom. Uh, we're going to upgrade you. We're going to upgrade you. Um. Um. I guess we'll, man, I want to do that, but at the same time, I kind of just don't want to do that. TBH. I want this health potion to go somewhere, man. But I also need jewels. I don't know. I guess we'll just go with this. This will work for me. We'll go with this. We'll go with this. Um, Hungry Blade and a Torch, huh? With a little bit of Dragon Skull. Okay, okay, okay. 
I think we're gonna lose this. A stamina, bro. I regret not getting a banana. Or like two of them. Because we can't really utilize the heat. Because our freaking brooms are just way too fast. Can I still win with just uh, poison and then blind? Berserker mode's a thing though. And he's got dragon skill armor. Fatigue's probably gonna kill us realistically. Yeah. But that changes this round, especially since we got a flawless sapphire. All right, we're selling you because I don't want you anymore. Um, I'm not upgrading you. I want all the strong mana potions that I can ever get. We are going to just put you up here. That could be an activator. I need space. Like, a lot, actually. <laughs> Where's my space? Um... I guess I could just do this. this is, I just realized that. I could literally just turn it and that, like, works. Okay, so I'm buying both of you. Roll. Do I want a blood goober? Not really. Yeah, not really. I don't really want a blood goober. I'm gonna get this potion belt and... I guess we'll put Flawless Sapphire there and Flawless, or what is this one? Flawless Sapphire, Flawless Sapphire. Oh, Flawed, okay. Put the Flawed Sapphire there, Flawless goes there. That's looking good. Everything's looking as good as it can be. I'm gonna roll. Don't care about that. Do I want another health potion? That's gonna be a lot of health potions. I don't know if I, I, don't, I really don't think I need that many health potions. I think I'll be fine with like three. So I'm just gonna stick with this. I'm not gonna get a fourth health potion. <laughs> or third, rather. Okay, spikes. Double claws with a thorny. Okay. Okay. But at least we have magic staff now. That's the big thing. Because now our DPS is just way better than just rocking two freaking brooms. Which is amazing. Berserker mode. He's got dragon scale armor, but we might be fine, I think. All because of Magus Staff doing a lot more DPS. A lot more DPS. Good game. Um, Let's grab you, you. Probably should have gotten this leather bag instead, but that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna roll here. Ooh, a mana orb is nice. Do I need to craft the crystal? I can upgrade you. Yeah, because I don't really, we, we don't really stack on poison, right? So, but it's on sale, so I'm just going to use it to upgrade, realistically. I think that's a better play. But we don't really inflict debuff, so I really don't want that inside of our armor slot. Um, But yeah, I'm getting this mana orb. I probably should have sold a, a jewel to get the mana orb. That might have been better. Um... I think I'm gonna sell both of these actually just to get this garlic because I'm gonna need a lot of activators <laughs> a lot Ooh, flame whoop he's also got the pineapple a lot of heat generation this guy's gonna be heated up I say we lose this friendly flame with the blueberry moving that up by one would have been better <laughs> but I, I think we lose this actually 60% where's the six blind? oh yeah the blind came from that and we, not to mention, we have no way of combating blind. He's going to keep on stacking blind because of that shovel, too. We're just going to have to bet on just hitting a fast. Really, really fast. Really, 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 really fast. Hopefully, if I get more heat. But he's got a heat generator himself. We're probably going to lose this one. He just scales better. Not to mention, when that 100 damage hits, we're dead. <laughs> we're freaking dead. Ding. Let me get you, you, and you. Do I need a third Gloves of Haste? I actually don't know if I need a third Gloves of Haste. I'm going to switch this situation up quite a bit now. Um, What we're going to do is just get rid of everything over there. We're going to triple Fanny you, and we're going to put the Cauldron on this side. Right there. As soon as I figure out how to do that. Boom. Um, We're going to put you up there. And in these slots, we'll just do a situation like this. Boom. But then again, we do have double gloves that we need to use. Hmm. So that is a little bit of a problem. Okay, this this will be fine though. This will be fine. 
What's the be? Or, I mean, I could just do this. Like, that works. And then I could still use this as an activator, right? That's probably just way better. Way better. Um, that can go like this. Um, actually, I could switch these two. And then I could put these back up here. That way I can put another potion right there. I mean, realistically, I could do this. And that way I just get more mana plus maximum health when they proc, right? Which would just help the magic staff. Assuming the magic staff isn't like, you know, already good when it comes to the mana generation. We'll go with this though. I'm, um, yeah, I'm digging this. Um, as far as this goes, that can go there. We can get a combination off of these two. That can go there. I do not think I need another gloves of haste, so we're just not gonna get one. Uh, well, yeah, I should probably give me another cap though. I'll get a cap because this one doesn't uh, is, isn't good against uh, dagger and hammer. So I'll, I'll give me another cap. Okay, still goober. Okay, a little bow and arrow action. Lots of critting. We'll see what happens here. And then he's also got the heart containers proccing too. I don't know if that second one's gonna proc though. Hopefully not, because that would be bad. We we generate way way more mana than we need. Do I win? Hell yeah, let's go. We generate a lot of mana, <laughs> surprisingly. Boom, let me get that divine potion. And I do want another mana orb, but I'm just gonna grab this cap or reseal instead. Um, we're going to put you there and get a strong divine potion. I might as well just get these. I mean, like, right? Like, I feel like I might as well just get the freaking upgraded health potions at this point, no? Because they're not getting lucky with blueberries in order to get more of these uh, mana potions, unfortunately. Burning Banner kind of sucks because it removes my buffs and I kind of need my mana. But we still might be fine as far as mana goes anyways. Hopefully just because of the cauldron situation and everything. That's what it looks like to me though. I mean, we're at seven, five, three, and it's still removing. Hmm. Are we going to be fine though? I think so. Our damage is getting up there. 48, two more hits and you're dead. Miss, not, nah, boom. Okay, magic stab. Now I was gonna go for an unhealing stab, but I'm kind of digging this magic stab situation. I'm gonna move this like that, just so we can get as many buffs as possible from there. And then we're gonna do that. Get this guy, roll. Blueberry, hello. Well, I am glad about that. Getting that too. That way we can get ourselves a super goobert. You know, I'm just not going to... Should I upgrade this health potion? Actually, no, no. I'm, I'm not going to upgrade the health potion. I'm just going to keep it like this. I feel like it'll be better. Yeah, I feel like it'll just be better. If I get me another blueberry, that'd be great. Because I need all the mana potions I can get. That's my goal, is all the mana potions I can muster, possibly. Wow, super cauldron with pananomium. Super cauldron, super pananomium. I've never seen a build like this before. That was actually pretty cool. But I think we're gonna win. <laughs> I've never seen a build like this before, but it is pretty cool, but yeah. <laughs> GG's on that one. What are we looking at? 12, I'm gonna get you just so I can get me a combination on, the, on this guy real quickly. Cause that would be amazing amazing and honestly bro i'm thinking we just sell some jewels here as well just enough to get a stone skate potion um so i can upgrade this goes of power <laughs> that was the only reason you can be a new activator this can go like that that can go up there. And honestly, this flying Arlick really doesn't even matter for real. I'm going to grab you. And the rest is history. Another burning banner. I know you want you an Excalibur because that thing is maxed out. Absolutely maxed out. Jeez. Woo! I love the mana bomb. It's a divine potion. Getting, what, 16 random buffs? It's actually really nice. Not to mention, this is this hasn't even procced yet on its own, you know what I mean? 
for him to not have an Excalibur, he's actually kind of strong. <laughs> not gonna lie. But that's game. <laughs> good game, good game. Another holy potion. Um, what are we at? Bop, bop, gimme, gimme. Space. I wasn't expecting to get two holy potions, but I will take two holy potions. Um, here's what we're going to do. Hear me out. <laughs> Hear me out. This needs to go there. Give me a Coon Goober. And I also got the activators. I need to double proc this potion. And to do that, we're going to do this. This needs an upgrade. Somehow. I guess I could just do that for the upgrade, and then this can just go there. Like that works for me. Like I'm not I'm not I'm not mad about that. That works for me. And then we'll just leave these two here like that. I'm gonna move these over here. We don't really need the mana generation from this uh, flawed sapphire either, so I think we're just gonna do that. If I combine, what is that? That's three, three. If I combine, I'm going to get the square, correct? And the square is this guy, which is four, which you in increases by 50%, so it'll be six. But I'm already getting six from these two. So like, well, I'm, I'm actually getting more because this is going to be increased by like 1.5, right? And after this, I'm not getting any more jewels. So I might as well just keep it like this. Might as well keep it like that and not actually combine those, I think. It's better play. Ooh, poison build. Okay. Snake, poison guru, plus serpent staff, and a death scythe. Is really cool, actually. Really, really cool. Look at the amount of block that I gain from the freaking, uh, from the sapphires, bro. From the... From the mana bomb <laughs> a lot of freaking block loads of it and then the rest of that mana literally well i mean it is uh, it was going to be used for the magic staff but if we had so much of the freaking mana orb use it all which is fine hopefully because uh, uh 86 poison is not nice how are you not dead 46 hit let me get another 47 we do gain a lot of block from the mana generation though which is great Ooh, that hurt. One more poison. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. Yeah, we're dead. The poison. I was not expecting that. I'll take that L, though. That was a fun game. That was a good game. Let me get space. I do definitely need this Dijon lamp, which I can probably, definitely, should probably get now. Um, And that way, I can use it as an activator, and it can touch this magic staff, which is something that needs to be a thing. I am lacking in activators, though. Which is extremely unfortunate. I'm just gonna move this over. <laughs> I know my Cauldron isn't a happy villain. I know he's not a happy Cauldron. But it'll be okay, because I, I need I need to proc these strong divine potions. That's a that's a thing that needs to happen. Um getting this garlic just for an activator. And yeah, we're just gonna stick it like this. Although, I guess I could just move this over here and put that below it or something. That wouldn't be bad, right? Probably not. Probably wouldn't be bad. Mana bomb? Mana bomb? Boom! Nice. Invulnerability. The plan is to get this lamp to proc. We just need spikes now. Because we're getting a block from the mana generation. And then the invulnerability from King Guru definitely helps with our early game survivability. We might lose this though, because it is a freaking cross blaze and a bone arrow, like. It is a cross blaze and a bone arrow. I just need one more spikes and, and a little bit more block. Okay, damn it. This is, God dang it. Give me that activator. Another activator. All right, we should be fine on activators. So this will go there. This guy's got to go there. We need one more, we need space too. All right, now we're fine on activators. Um, I guess I could just try this, though. Technically, I could try this, too. Well, no. Uh, what's this? Three seconds? Two seconds? Hmm. I'll leave it there, I suppose. I'll leave it there. I'll leave it there. Um. It's a lot of mana orbs. Um. 
I'm debating if I should get this flying Arlick. We don't really need it though, right? For another activator? Like, we really don't. And the gloves of haste we don't really need either, but we only got four gold and this is the last round. So I feel like we might as well get the gloves of haste, but I don't know where to put it. I guess I could put it on the magic staff like this. That works. We got a super mana build. Ooh, going against a super ice build. Ouch. Alrighty. And we're already, this magic staff is already going to be slow because of the double uh, gloves of power. So that's like a thing. One more spikes, please. Oh, we also need clovers. Oh, there goes the other proc, though. So now we just need one more clover. We got the proc. Doing 84 damage per hit. All that empowerment, all that heat. Oh, the, the uh, strong divine potions pretty much cleansed all the cold at the beginning. So he's like super weak right now while we're like super strong. Wow, that was really good. That's one way to combat ice build is just get a bunch of divine potions. Utilize the buffs you gain from that to get yourself a gin proc. And next thing you know, you got a staff doing 87 to 90 damage. You feel me? Like, not bad. And then utilizing all that mana generation for all the block uh, gain. You know what I mean? 87 from just one. 103 actually. From one jewel and then 60 from the other. And then the gloves of power. Lots of block generation. Loads. Loads of block generation. Look at that. Loads of block generation just for mana generation. And the mana just is used for everything. All the buffs you can gain in the world. Not to mention the buffs you gain from the uh, the mana or procs themselves. Really good. Really good game. I wonder if I could rock this with two ma magic staffs. That would be interesting. But yeah, really good game. Appreciate you guys watching. Yeah, I had fun. I'll see you guys in the next one.